Today I'm going to show you how to create this awesome slide only using PowerPoint. Ok, let's get started. So first I'll go to insert, then I'll click on word art and click on this. If I click on this I'll have a text box and I'll write text. So I'll write hard work beats talent. Done. So this is my theme. Then I'll just go to align and align to center and I'll go to align again and align to middle. So it's right in the middle of the slide. Then I'll drag over all of it or I can press ctrl A to select it all and go to home and make it dagger square font. You can download this dagger square font free from the internet. Then I'll click on this S to get rid of the shadow. So I have something like this. Then I'll drag up all of it and then I'll go to this point, font color and make it 25% lighter black color. Done. For the next part, I'll click on this and when I have this sign, I'll press Ctrl D to duplicate it. And then I'll just drag over all of it or Ctrl A. Then I'll create this symbol. Then I'll just increase the size of it a bit more. Alright, like this. Then I'll put it right over here. Then I'll press Ctrl D to duplicate it again and put it rotate it first and then put it right over here. I'll press Ctrl and holding and Ctrl I'll click on this then right click on them and group them together. So I have these two things grouped together. So what I will do is just put them right in the middle. So the same process align center and align middle. So you have something like this. Then I'll right click on it go to group and ungroup them. So you have two separate things. Then Next, I'll create a box. So I'll go to insert, then go to shapes and pick this rectangle over here and just drag it on top of it. Just like that. Smooth. Then I'll go to shape outline and create no outlines and go to shape fill and I'll go to more fill colors and pick a color like this. Something, a paste color maybe it would be nice. Just like this. Then right click on it and send it to back. Just like that. Done. So this color just pops up on it because the two, these two colors have high contrast. Now what I will do is click on this thing, press Ctrl D and I have the same slide, two slides. Alright, now what I will do is click on the box and go to shift fill and make it black. Now you cannot see the text. So I'll drag over all the text and then I'll make them this color. Alright. So we are pretty much done over here. Then what I will do is just drag over all of it, the entire slide or you might press Ctrl A to select it all. Then I will press Ctrl C or you can just simply copy it. Then I will go to this slide and right click here over here and you have two options use destination theme or use picture. So we are going to have to pick the picture. So we have a picture over here. Then I will put it right on top of the before slide. Then I'll go to format, I'll go to crop, then I'll go to crop to shape and you have many options. So if I pick this, you can have something like this and if I squeeze it a bit, you can see we have something sort of like this. So you can experiment with the crop. So crop to shape, you can create this and you can with this yellow dot you can customize it as much as you like. Or you can go to crop shape again and create this triangle over here and make it like this. Or you see, because you have a very much freedom with your work, so you can create any type of design you want and it's a nice design which is being created. So that's the trick for you and that's how you create some awesome slide on PowerPoint. And I'm gonna keep it like this and stretch it like over here. Done. Hard work beats talent. Alright, so this conveys our message and it's a split. So we are done with the presentation. Thanks for watching the entire presentation. And if you have any idea about making a presentation, just type it in the comment section or you can contact me on our Facebook account, which is Summon Sadiq or PowerPoint Pro. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share with your friends and family. Have a great day.